Good morning! Well, it's been a while since we've done a video. Uh, I've been out of the warehouse for a couple weeks and we're very short staffed, so uh, uh, yeah, we haven't had them. So uh, I'm really excited to get back to show you some of the cool things that are in the warehouse. We're hopefully back to our regular scheduled uh, broadcasting. <laughs> I'm doing these videos um, as often as we can, hopefully once a day or so. Uh, but yeah, I thought I would show you some of these really cool um, furniture pieces we have in the warehouse. Um, I will quickly show you we have a ton of furniture. This is um, our furniture section. We have a couple other rooms that have some select pieces in them. Um, so if you're in the market for furniture, come check out the warehouse because there's a lot of really cool stuff here. Um, but I did want to show you just these three um, really small pieces because I think each one of them has uh, a really cool uh, feature about them. So yeah, let's get started. So this one is, first of all, is only 28 bucks, which I think is great. Uh, but it's got really great, really beautiful classic hardware, uh, three drawers. It's a, it's a really, as you can see, here's my hand, uh, um, a fairly small piece, but I think what makes it cool is I'm pretty sure it was for sewing. Cause check out what's in the top drawer. It's got all these little spindles. And I think, um, please correct me if I'm wrong, <laughs> but I think, um, yeah, this is for putting spools on. You just lift these up. They fit into like these little grooves here, you can see. So yeah, you can put your spools on there and then just pull the string. So um, if that's not what they're actually for, um, I think it would work really well for that. So, <laughs> so that, that works too. Um, yeah, so it's got some cool storage compartments there. Uh, and then the drawers below. Just really fun these. I mean, if you don't sew, um, it would make a really good um, end table for a small space as well, just because of its small size. But it's got a lot of cool features as well. These really great rounded corners. Look at the legs. It has some turn detail. And I think, you know, when you have a uh, small space, having a piece of furniture that's up off the floor like that um, really gives it a lighter look because um, it's not taking up as much floor space. Um, so yeah, whether you kept it here, there's a little bit of um, issues with the, the finish on the top, but for 28 bucks, it'd be a good either refinishing project or painting project. Uh, yeah, just a really, really cool little piece. And maybe you can find something else to do with these if you're not a big sewer. But if you are, man, I think that would be really cool. I'm just really fascinated by how that works. And then next to it, this, I think this is so cool. Okay, so I'm gonna be completely honest. I, I don't know what it is. I'm assuming that it has a very specialized function that I don't know. Um, what caught my eye is just the uh, really unique kind of a design of it with the big um, circle on top. It looks like a big Swiss cake roll. Maybe I'm hungry, but um, <laughs> it reminds me of the ho, -ho. Uh, But the, check it out, look how it operates. So we've got this tambour um, wooden top. Here's the, um, the pole. So you just lift up and that whole tambour part just slides down the back. Can you see that? So yeah, it turns up straight. And then, um, sorry, it's hard to do one-handed, but I'm holding the camera. But um, it actually slides really, really well as you can see. But I really love the way that functions. And then, yeah, there's like a little uh, space here uh, with a, um, a space underneath it. I mean, I don't know, it might be a really good, um, what do you call it, laptop case. I think you could probably fit in there and just got a little spot there with a hole for maybe cords. Um, and then underneath here, um, there are these four pegs. So I think you could put either uh, a piece of glass or a piece of wood and make a shelf there. Yeah, just a really, really cool piece. Um, it's 95 bucks. Uh, but yeah, I really love the way that um, that top functions. I think it's really, really cool. Just the way it slides down the back. Um, and yeah, I hadn't seen one like that before, so I was pretty excited. <laughs> Look at that. And then next to it, I think this this coffee table is so cool. So coffee table is 48 bucks. Uh, it's fairly long. It's got this glass top. But what I think makes it great is this kind of a wooden screen that goes all the way around the edges. Um, it's pretty... Uh, or you can see it's missing some pieces, but um, I actually think that makes it um, even cooler. To me, it makes it feel like it's uh, got some miles on it. It's a little bit older of a coffee table and you know, has a, it gives it a little bit of history. Uh, I guess you could try to replace those pieces if you uh, do not like that vibe. <laughs> but if you do, I feel like this coffee table is right up, right up your alley. I, I picture it in a, a, a very white room with a lot of uh, kind of uh, um, very textured uh, textiles and uh, kinds of things. I don't know, kind of like bohemian, maybe kind of chic vibes. I don't know. I just thought it was a really great coffee table. So yeah, those three pieces, and like I said, we've got a ton more um, here at the warehouse. So 
If you're in the market for furniture, come check it out. We're open every day from 12 to 5 p.m. And you can uh, um, walk through and uh, yeah, find your next furniture treasure. So you can also check out some furniture on our marketplace and that is communityforkmarketplace.org. So, all right, well, thanks a lot for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, have a great day.